Hello and welcome to a quick <coughs> bonus update on uh, something else I've done down here. So I had <coughs> one of these small shelves left over from the ones I bought from Amazon. I'd used four for the Star Trek ships, one for the Ghostbusters, one I put over there. And I had one spare and I wasn't sure where to put it. And I was going to put it up there above that Dark Crystal figure, but it was too high. And just thought, well, I can't really see anything on there to be awkward to get to. It was above the top of the bookcase, but... So I was thinking where else to put it, and then I had a thought. So I've got all my Star Trek pops in there and some other ones as well. But I had some space above. Obviously, I couldn't put a bigger shelf there because of that. And it wouldn't have fit there, and if I use one of these IKEA ones, then basically I wouldn't have been able to use the end part anyway, so... I decided to put this up here. So I was thinking about what to put on there. So I did think about putting those four out some six bolt heads on there, but uh, they're basically they're too big. Well, the local one was, I think they're all too big for there. Or I had tried to see those DC bombshell ones I got, the Harley Quinn and Miriam ones would have gone on there. But again, they were too big and I couldn't really put the shelf any lower. So I was thinking, what do I want to put on there? I don't want to I want to put pops in there because I've got pops on these other shelves and stuff. So I have got those Ekith figures I bought. Um, I've also got the Vinyl Mace figure I could put up there, but I decided to put the Ekith up there. So I'll put up the two from Rock and Modern Life, Rock and, and Heifer, and the three from Val Rocco, Heifer and Spunky, and the Ren and Stimpy ones. I have put the labels on there, although you can't see them. But, um, yeah, I mean, they do do the um, shelves like those on Amazon, but then available in the three different sizes. So, I mean, technically, I could have put one of those up there instead with the labels on. Much as I could have done with the Star Trek ships, but obviously they're bigger, so, you know, they wouldn't have fit on the sh shelf that deep. And I don't know how deep those other ones were. And then the ones compared to the IKEA one, so and obviously the Ghostbusters car that's better. So yeah, potentially I could have put those on. But I mean they are on a shelf in a space I'm not using and the labels are on there. I mean I know what they are anyway. I mean I originally was gonna do labels of those, but I thought, you know, try and get everything with a label. Even if I know what it is, just so it makes things easier. So yeah, I've got those up there and they fit in there fine. And I've kept the space above those. Not that I needed extra space above there, but I'll keep a little bit of space just so it's not cramped. So yeah, I put those up there. I've still got some more down there. I need to put the labels with them. And I've got some more on the shelves there, but so I have moved some of those off. So those when they should all be together in one place. But then the pops on, are they? Because I've got pops there and pops over there and pops over there and pops over there. So, you know. So, what I could either do is look at those other shelves, the ones that got the lip on the front. And that, nothing I'm not sure on how big the lip is on the front, in terms of labels. Or just get some wire down and stop them around where I can and put some more of the uh, those figures on there. Because, uh, I mean, yeah, ideally I'd like them to all be the same. So I have the labels on the front, but, you know, you have to, you have to do what you do. And, um, as I said, they're unbalanced on the front because it's quite thin, that bit, front bit. <coughs> so I do want to get rid of these, uh... I want to get the Fallout figures somewhere, but I want to get rid of these Eekies figures and Finamate figures out, up. Obviously the door was all going on the stairs anyway so and then I need to still move these pops here and vinyl because they're they need to go up somewhere but I have got um, some bare shelves at the moment I can use but uh, yeah so they look good there I mean so as I said I'd rather have all these sort of shelves but especially as they're not you know 
big as those in terms of the size they take up, but you know, it's a shelf I wasn't using and that is somewhere so fine. I, I mean, I was thinking about putting it above deck, but I've got the signs there and I mean, potentially could have put the signs elsewhere and I mean, I possibly could have put them there and then I could, I mean, I could probably like too much effort getting to the shelf above there. He said, I'm putting one there, but I'll put the signs there. Um, I mean, there are stuck up with double sided tapes. So I mean, I could see if I could get them off easily, move them and put a shelf there. And I'll clear the rest of those pops off there. I'd have to make sure that I could reach over and get the shelf up first, but and those aren't perfectly straight anyway. I just put, well, Chemical Slake signs more straight, but the Elm Street one's sort of. Um, lean to the right a bit downwards, so but, uh, yeah, so I'll move some more stuff. So, finally, getting these figures all organized. But yeah, I need to I need to move this off the floor now. I've got some room on here, and I can shove them on there. And then I'll decide which shelf I want to get next and where I'm going to put them. I think probably best check where I'm going to put them first before I order them because no point buying them, just assuming I've got somewhere to put them and then haven't got space. Ooh, I suppose I can get to at the moment. So yeah, just thought to uh, sort of really do a little video to show that, and then uh, say there will be a proper full date. As I said, uh, either this will go up after the video I mentioned it, or if it doesn't, and it goes, it goes before I'm doing a proper full date. That's episode 100, so that will be a whole like proper look at everything, or. You know, one just like this is what I've just done. It'd be like, like I used to do, this, show everything. But um, yeah, that's just it. I just wanted to show that anyway. So that's it for this episode. Thanks for watching.